Paris <laughs> says, I might be one of them <laughs> with a chip in his head. Yeah, yeah. You know? yeah, that's why I like Shishimi with the tanks. I don't like play online. Like, yeah, me neither. Like, like, Shishimi all dressed in black like with the hat. She looks like uh, Yeah. Why not this hand? She's about ready to go burgle somebody's house, you know? She's dressed like a burglar. That's 500, right? Yes. Okay. A cute burglar, but a burglar nonetheless. No, no, no. Okay. No, no, no. If it was like 200, then I would probably take it back. Rampage, four bets to 6,000. Terrace with the Cowboys. Shashimi will get out of the way. And B Dunn has all the other tens. Unfortunate for B Dunn. No more tens left. Okay, I'm not going anywhere now, for sure. <laughs> Give me my car bunch. I checked. Like, help me. Big pot brewing here three ways. Terrace checks. Rampage does hit a little piece of this. Terrace with the kings and the king of hearts on a three heart board. Does he know he checked? He checked oh. in the dark. Oh, he know that? Okay. Yeah, he knew that. In the dark, like how many? Oh, yeah. Has he ever been here? Everybody laughs at Helmuth, but actually think he's not that, like, he's pretty good, you know? Yeah. I think everybody underestimates him. His tournament results speak for themselves. Yeah. <clears throat> I think he's extremely good at reading people, like some sort of crazy magic, white magic or whatever. <clears throat> Tough spot here for B Dunn. SPR already now won. No more tens in the deck. He doesn't know that. Ten of hearts, over pair. Terrace checked in the dark. God knows what he has. Moment. And he rips oh, it. All in. B Dunn, 22,600. Terrace no longer talking about little? Phil Helmuth. He wants a count. Some purples, 20. It's like 22. 23. <clears throat> Terrace has Rampage behind him. To a four bet pre. 22, 4, 25. 25,000? 22. 22, 5. 4, 25. Okay, 22,000. Okay. I think more. Yeah, yes, right. 22,000. 22,400. Okay, let me think. Uh, I mean, I think that Doug Polk's solver, Lucid, the Lucid solver, would probably not approve of me folding this, to be honest. But the thing is, it only simulates when it's two players, but now we have three. Ah. <laughs> uh. What do we think, chat? Interesting. Terrace too rich to fold. I call. Makes the call. And Rampage gets out of the way. B Dunn sees the bad news, and he's drawing dead, right? So the uh, Sashimi so folded two tens. Hearts are covered. I mean, hearts or king, I guess. You cannot be in better. You can lock this one up. One time. 67.8. All right, let's do the ones. They're going to run it once. One turn, one river. Both players now with the flush and the check mark for Terrace. You still have a bunch of votes. You for a while, too. 
Pretty sure. Okay. And Terrace is going to stack. Be done. Well, see, ducks, duck pokes, lucid GTO solver, or um, yeah, simulator or whatever. It's very helpful. Yeah, duck poke. <laughs> Terrace now up fifty-four thousand. Yeah, we'll go over a few of the events here after this hand. Okay. Mo flops the set here. Open ender for Trey. Trey fires out a thousand with the open ender. I'm always going to look again to make sure it is in fact a set. Actually, American like that place. This place is American sushi. Just calls there. Like, uh, Terrace will get out of the way. And it's, uh, not like a, shortly yeah. after uh, the Civil War in America, by the way, sushi. Oh, oh no. my God. Yeah. It's just not right for Mo right now. <laughs> Trey vaults to the lead straight. You know that was from here? Abraham. I didn't know. I saw that. No, Abraham Rankin. Was... And he rips it. All in. All in? No, yeah. Snap call. Makes the call. Mo needs a board pair. All of a sudden, a $38,000 pot. You called it last time, I'll let you call it this time. Go ahead, two down. Okay. They're going to run it twice. Mo needs a board pair. Has not been his day. There's the board pair. Mo gets the first one. Seven's full. And Mo said, why didn't I just run it once? Because then, it gets there both times. Mo, when it's going bad the whole day, you wait and you flop a set on hand number 61. But then you get turned pretty much dead and bink two river cards. Uh -huh. Mo's back. <laughs> Mo is back. <laughs> Welcome back, Mo. Mo uh -oh. money, Mo problems. Thank you. And there you go. Hand number 61, the thank you comes in. <laughs> there is the hand. If you had thank you on hand number 61, you are the winner tonight. Absolute bink on those two river cars, and Trey is stunned. Here at the Lodge, at Lodge Card Club. 5K in the live chat and growing. We appreciate all the support, folks. Jim Bonics with the super chat. Thank you, Jim Bonics. Always nice seeing Jim Bonix, whether it be in person or virtually in the chat. Yeah, he's a huge fan. Heads up, Mo Money and Be Done, both with their knit button. And how about trips for Be Done and Diamond a flush draw. draw for Mo? Mo's been pretty quiet so far, 36 hands into the show. Both players with their knit button. We could have fireworks. Are you ordering food? Raises right away to 1600 Be done. No longer concerned about the menu. More focus on those dollar-dollar bills. Puts down the menu, and we'll see a turn card. Brick.
Bo plays his own style. Pretty famous for the overbets, and we see one here on the turn. All in, All in from B. Dunn. Who wastes no time. 5,000 more for Mo to call. And Mo's wondering now, how did we get here? He makes the call. Makes here the we go. Call. Mo looking for a diamond that's... Mm. Gambling is happening. Not the deuce, I guess. Nine. There's the boat mm. for B-Dunn. Yeah. And he's going to win a nice $24,000 pot. Yeah, 